Hi there, my name is Amanda Hill from the Social Media Cafe and in this video we're going to look at some of the must-have plugins for your WordPress site. Now WordPress is one of the most used platforms for building a website in. It overtakes virtually everything out there and there's a reason for that. It's very easy to use, it's very easy to update. You can also use it to rank incredibly well for different spaces online, particularly Google, which is where most of the searches are these days. Now, there's so many different things that you can do with it. And this is a new site that we've been working on this week. So we're going to look at what we've added that we wouldn't have added in the past. So some of our favourite plugins. Let's go and show you. Now, your WordPress site probably looks something like this. And you can find your plugins just here. Now, most of them, you can literally just go to install plugins and add new to find it. Occasionally, perhaps for an upgraded version, you're going to have to download it and upload it. And you'd still do it from here. So have a think about what it is you want it to do and then you can go and just search. So let's just show you where that is with add new. And you can literally go and search or you can just upload something. Let's just get rid of this one for now. So you can either click upload of whatever it is you've downloaded. So remember where you've put it or just go and click in keywords here and type in what it is you want it to do. So let's just have a quick look at what we've added recently and why. So we added auto publish for Google My Business, one of the places you absolutely should be and you should have it there and updated. It's the first place people will find you if you do it well because they're looking on their phones for what you do. Then we've got Bing Webmaster Submission. You just need to activate that with the API from your Bing account. Now, ours is not updated quickly yet, so by today or tomorrow, we should be able to activate that so it can automatically submit for us. Then we've added HubSpot Bot All-in-One Marketing. So this is a really cool way to just get stuff straight into your CRM system. So you can put forms and pop-ups and even live chat so that people can get in touch and you can help them. Now we've added Hummingbird. So Hummingbird is going to make your site load faster. So from file compression to browser caching, lots of different ways it's going to do it. And with the changes for Google, you're going to need to be fast, responsive and keep people on your page. So it's definitely worth you having an investigate into this. Now, we thought we'd play with this and see if it works. I don't know if it does yet, but who knows? Now, you do need backlinks on every single thing that you do. It's not enough anymore to just have quality content. Now it could be, this is not going to work at all and it gives backlinks that are detrimental to the business. But until you try and test something, how do you know? Everybody needs a picture. In all fairness, we use Canva more than anything for varying things and we take our own content wherever possible. However, Pexels prov provides you with free stocking images for you to use. Literally browse, download what you need, and then you can just crop, compress or whatever and use them to highlight everything that you do. Make sure that you actually optimise the picture name and everything that you're doing with it as well. So all your alt tags so people can actually get a much better experience and you get found in Google. Now, wh whichever way you're going to get backlinks for your site, you're going to need to monitor things. 
So this is going to check if your links are live or not. And it's absolutely worth you taking a look. The site kit by Google is a great way for you to be successful. So go and have a look and see what it will do for you. Smush, what a word, how cool. This is going to reduce the sizes of your files and absolutely help you to go up the rankings in Google. You definitely need something like this on your site to make sure that your images are at their best size. Now there's lots of social media and share icons on there. This is one we're playing with for now, but hey, who knows, we may well change it for another one. Widgets for Google reviews. Seen them, they pop up when you've got reviews on your Google site. And how cool is that? It's credibility straight in front of your target audience. So definitely worth you looking at. I've added this and a couple of others, but you can see it's not active right now. We had a slight conflict with something. So we're going to go and investigate and see why. But if you are dealing with a B2B audience and you do want content to go out to LinkedIn, then it may be one to help you automate that process. Now, robots.txt files. These are really useful for certain people doing um, high-end SEO and to help you to get found quicker and easier and help Google to crawl it. That's what this file is all about. You may or may not need it, but it's definitely worth a look at if you're looking in a very competitive world or you're trying to get somewhere quickly. And of course, SEO solutions for WordPress would not be the same without Yoast SEO. You're going to get sitemaps, you're going to get on-page analysis, and then all you have to do is fill in the bits as you're doing it. Absolutely one for you to have immediately. Now, what we haven't put on here yet are going to be protectors for the site to stop spamming, to stop people trying to infiltrate it. And there's a whole heap of other plugins, but I shall do another video on whatever else we've added. But this is stage one of work in progress. Hope they've been helpful to you.